Hey there, Black Light. It's Brutus here. Last week I was watching a Psycho Rabbit video and he was using one of these light, ultralight builds and I said, I gotta get into this. I added a few things like the silencer and the scope, but basically this whole setup is Psycho Rabbits. So this one's dedicated to you, buddy. And I tell you something, it's pretty quick. It gives the speeder the best M4X speed you can get. If speed is your importance. Uh, the suppressor addition gives you a, a control of the uh, recoil, which is very good, especially for the hip fire. Uh, the light barrel, of course, for the speed, everything. The, the scope is the twist here. Uh, that's the one that really brings in that mid-range, so you can get mid-range shots pretty easily. And the ultralight stock makes it very quick for the speeder. So it, it, it's just really cool. Let's get some gameplay here. Uh, Helo deck is perfect for this. And it's, I'm so frail at 152, so I'm going to have to use the scope, the HRV cloak, that is uh, extensively, so I can sneak up on people before they see me and fire. Now, usually like a, a really fatty fatty with a 250, I, I really have to get behind them and just go, oh, spinning back first. Yeah, get behind them and uh, and just lay havoc. 750 rounds per minute, it's uh, pretty fast. So it doesn't have to be one degree more or less. It's still gonna put six, seven, eight bullets into you. Um, oh, let's see, oh, okay. He didn't see me, let's see. Oh, he already turned around. See there, no head to heads. Not unless I'm a little stronger, maybe change the vest or something. You can still get pretty fast, even if you're going with a, uh, a cruiserweight type of armor instead of a lightweight. And let's see how many of these. Oh, they didn't, they're not aware. Oh, that's a sneaky spot. <laughs> but you notice I was the, the moves very clean from line to line. So uh, I, I'm liking the balance on this particular build for the. Uh... Now, of, of course, there's. Uh, if you remember, we did a different build for the chasing uh, shark head video which had more of a recoil of stock and more power front end, which is also good. But I, I find the move on this to be exquisitely easy. So it just really tones it down so you can really uh, hip fire with, without too much uh, rec recoil, just bouncing with a jackhammer. And you can still run away from bombs like that. Oh, there you go, so you just clip right there. I was fast enough to get away though and get around them as much as I can. And oop, you didn't see me come through and back of the head there. Yeah, a little popsicle there. I didn't get it. Oh, damn. Yeah, move along. Now I only have 81 health. I'm gonna have to really, really uh, tiptoe around here. Yeah. Let's see, uh, I've got uh, one little bullet and yep, sure enough. <laughs> Okay, get some health next time. Get them Gogurt protein pudding pops. Okay, hide in the bushes. And I'll see no head to head. He's already firing. Almost got him through though, but no. You gotta really be sneaky. Like a rabbit. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, he got close before I got there. Oh, the incoming. Hello! Very fast. I mean, this, this is as fast as it gets, as far as uh, real-time play. As far as I know, unless you have some dubious thing you want to tell us about. Okay. <laughs> uh, oh, they've already taken care. All right. The the speed is very nice. I'm usually used to a heavier player with a heavier gun because that's where I'm from, heavy land. But this is fast. I mean, yeah. The, the, the uh, recoil is uh, pretty much uh, end nozzled there with the silencer. You only get shave a few points off the demo. Uh, everyone's being smart and staying undercover. So I gotta move on. Front. Now, if they all up front, I can get into that middle section. And, uh, oh, are they still alive? Yes. And he, oh, just barely. Either that or, oh no, you got hose right there. Okay. Let's see, they're all still over there. So, use this middle section here. Oh, somebody came by. Somebody, oh, they're all back, back and forth, they're running. 
Gotta get somebody. And shadows. Lovely shadows. Hey! Into. Oh, man. Good cover. Yeah, this is what it looks like. Oh! But I had enough speed to actually pull out and not get completely uh, killed. But now I'm gonna get my lollipop. Get my little protein builder lollipop here. Let's go. <laughs> fast, fast, fast. Oh, there's a cloaker just went by me. Oh, man. Oh, oh. Ooh, I got away. I, ooh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> the grenade of it. The no head to head. You can't head to head it. You'll slightly lose tactical assistance. Okay. I keep remembering these things. No head to head, man. Brutus, stay hidden. Maraud, assassinate. Oh, the car. Look at me. I just blow the bits. All right. Let me see. Where? Oh, all over there again. If I can blow up somebody. Nope. <laughs> Everyone moved out of the way. Uh, that was a Hail Mary anyway. A, a chance shot. Let's get some life. I wonder what a flavor that is. Like strawberry or something. Get a little angle here. Let's see if I can get somebody off the doorway. And see how the, the uh, 3.9 just hones right in. I don't have to worry about aim with this one. It gives you a big opening so I can see most of what I'm doing. Unlike, uh, the, the combo scope is really good and really straight, but, and really fast, but it's really small and it's really, uh, it's obstructed. Well, this one pulls them right in and hits nothing, apparently. <laughs> okay. That's lagvation. Oh, and death by uh, gamer, Mr. Fatty Pants. Oh. Oh, double. See, with that scope, it's very easy to hone in and keep your line. So that's, I think that's the missing piece in this particular puzzle. And the, the choice of muzzle, really. Some people like a little, more, a little bit more power on the front end. So you can put like a power muzzle of any kind you like. Or an extended muzzle if you want a little bit more reach. When you start uh, changing barrels, you start changing the nature of this gun. Even though it's the same speed, it might be a slower move. Or, or let's say with a long range barrel, you get, of course, another 10 yards. But uh, with uh, but it may, it makes the move very uh, difficult. Or if you get the ultra light one, it also makes the uh, the power go down really fast. So kind of negate the reason. But oh, here you can pinpoint really easily right through the gates. That's that scope working on the same gun. I tried other scopes and it was just too unwieldy, too big for the actual weapon. Oh, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get some life. I'm gonna get hose here. Oh. Oh man, they threw everything at me. Okay. Oh damn. Oh, okay, couldn't get them both. I took too much damage from that rocket. And see if I can get anyone here. Oh, there. Winning one and this I got another one coming, don't you fret? This was just a what I get? 15-8, okay. So I gave into my frailty here. Hopefully I'll do better the next one. And the next one's gonna come up in three, two, one. I think it's come up now. Naps with the gold. What's with the gold? <laughs> it's ridiculous. I mean, one thing about the gold, it kind of semi-city camouflages you a little bit. Just a little bit. You look like a statue. Or like one of those mimes in the park that's all gold. You get skin cancer. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is a capture the flag. I remember this one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. This one really tested the, the uh, limits of the gun because uh, you got distances that are farther than 77. And you're at the... And, oh, and I didn't check. And I walked right in. Dummy. Noob, you're a noob. Don't you love it? Like going back to Kitten Garden. And, okay, there we're safe over there. Now, uh, I, I know a lot of you have played this kind of round before, but the ultimate idea is for one guy to, to go slowly with the flag and other people supporting that person, not just floating around playing Deathmatch 2.0, like I'm doing now. Um, so somebody's gotta get it, and then somebody's gotta actually help them bring it. So we're gonna get in here. 
Okay, so let's let, let's see what's actually going on. Let's get with my group. Where are they going to? Gotta get to where the enemy flag is going to. But not get killed on the way. Get out the opposition, opposition. Right now we're one zero. Everyone's gonna move in, okay. So teamwork is very important here. With like dominations or, or different uh, other team play, you, you can get in there, hold a place, claim it. But uh, with a flag, you really have to support the flag bearer, whoever has captured that flag. Or else they're just gonna keep dropping it because they can't speed, they can't press shift and run with it. So they're either super powered or, or they have support. Okay. Somebody's protecting. Nobody's protecting. Now back up in here. Oh, just missed his head by inches. Now he's gonna go for the flag. So I'm gonna stay, stay above here. Try to get in there, make sure that he doesn't, oh, he's coming to hose him. Another brother, eh? brother there, he there. can't see me. Can't see me. Okay, where is it? I'm trying to make sure that we don't get a lot of infiltration. That way at least we can protect our flag and keep the score where it is. Uh, I can see two people protecting their flag. I'm going to hide my signature. And let's see, oh. They probably can come in from the front here. Again, testing the limits of the distance. Getting out there will be a little, well, it shouldn't be too much. If I can see you, let's say, halfway at the scope, I think you'd be able to reach you. Let's see, anybody get trepidation here? They can see me now, so I better get out of the way. And turn it on! Okay. See, they're still protecting. So I'm gonna try to get in here. Oh, one guy hosed. The other one has turned his back. Two, two! <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, and I get electric for my trouble. And that's how they infiltrate people. You wait till their tur backs are turned, occupied elsewhere. Boom, boom, there you are. Oh, man. Oh, so clean the line. Okay, now I have the flag. I'm all alone. And I'm trying to fight my way out. Let's see if I make it. Let's see if I make it. No, too many people. And, oh, damn. Oh, damn. <laughs> and the last guy fight. It's just too many people. I tried to do it all myself. And like a, uh, let's see, oh man, death from above. But I'm close enough at the stairs for the gun to work. Uh, and, uh, okay, everyone's protecting the flag again. Ah. Okay, they're all coming up from the flank. Protect, go. Now the guy on the left, he's going to come up the ridge or we'll stay behind, let's see. Going back inside. So he's looking down the corridor and I am coming up his flank. And he tries to get away. Oh, he was mid HRV. I know that feeling. Mid HRV and there you are. You just can't do nothing. Can't I at least melee in HRV? Please, devs. Please, melee in HRV. That would be the only fair thing, really. There's no reason. We can do everything else in HRV. We can run, reload. I mean, why can't we fire? Or at least melee. Give him a kick in the balls. If he's right there. That's not an advantage. Oh. Oh, smarty. He kept back. Let me see. He just take that corner. He went back into the building. Around the corner. Get behind these guys. Oh. Let me see. Do I get the other guy? Oh, thank you. Support group. Support group. And we got a... What is that? Another one? Yeah, two. All right. That's how you do it. Let's see if we can get another one before the... Uh, Three minutes, we got three minutes to go. HRV jammer on, warming up. Active. Oh, 
Okay, uh, slight bit of lag, of course, is the, the famous uh, lag that we experience, but sometimes you get lucky and you just set up in the right place and the right people show up that correspond to, to your area. And don't muck it up for everybody. It's really... Being a, uh, half a second behind is kind of like, oh, just, just so easy hip fire. And cut that short, okay. And I returned my flag for, and got killed for my trouble. 2-2-2 two, two, two Freya. Maybe I'll use this weapon in the future with, uh, with the uh, cruiserweight armor. That way uh, I'm not super fast, but I am faster and a little bit heavier and I can deliver more. And survive it, that's the only thing. And be able to, to buy a popsicle. Let's see. Oh, cloak. Oh, that, that's the one advantage of cloak. Is that, uh, once you're out of HRV, I mean, th that is unless you have something you want to tell us. <laughs> okay, he's coming up this way. Hello. Now, support your guy. Stay behind him. Make sure that you're in the way between. Yeah, looking back. He's going to cover your own. Okay, he's going downstairs. So cover the back. Follow, follow, follow. Follow, follow. Support. And be there to grab the flag if it gets hosed. All right. See, that's how you do it. And then this guy, this guy knows what he's doing. I'm going to follow him for a little bit. See where he's going. Going right back to the flag. He's driven. I'm going to support the flag here. See if I can get without. No, that hurts too much. <laughs> oh, and they see me now. Oh, man. Incendiary. The, uh, the only reason why I don't get incendiary protection is because you're, it's survivable. And it's not like the snot, which sticks with you and lowers your... Uh, okay, now I've got it. Let's see if somebody supports me. Uh, they're all over there. I got 26 seconds. It's doubtful that I'll reach it. So, but I'm going to see if I can try here. I'm coming right beeline to that. Nobody behind me. Or in front of me. There's somebody who's already... Protecting. Oh, there's too many people. I'm gonna get hosed before I get there. Already somebody shooting at me. Come on, come on. Five seconds, four seconds, three seconds. Oh, I went too far. Yeah, and I got hosed for my trouble. Ah, ha, ha. Okay, but that was still good. What did I get there? Eh, it was a 15 5. Not bad. 3 to 1 ratio for the old Brutus. Hey, thanks for tuning in. So, Welcome Psycho Rabbit to the family. I love it. I'm going to use him with a heavier guy, but I love it. Thank you, Psycho Rabbit. Have a good one. Bye-bye.